In 1869, the Republic of Izo was proclaimed in Japan's Izo area, now Hokkaido. It was established by former soldiers of the Tokugawa shogunate, which ruled Japan from 1603 to 1868. The Republic aimed to create a democratic government, but only the samurai caste had voting rights. Unfortunately, the Republic of Izo lasted a mere five months before being absorbed into the newly formed Empire of Japan. During the Tokugawa period, also known as the Edo period, Japan was governed by the Tokugawa family from Edo, now Tokyo. They enforced a strict social hierarchy and class system, with samurai at the top, followed by peasants, artisans, and merchants. The Tokugawa shogunate pursued an isolationist policy, cutting off most interactions with other countries for about 220 years. Although there were some limited trade and cultural exchanges, Japan largely remained isolated from the rest of the world. In 1868, the Meiji Restoration brought an end to the Tokugawa shogunate and ushered in a period of political and social change in Japan. Power was restored to the emperor, and the shogunate system was dismantled. However, some Tokugawa loyalists and former military groups opposed the Meiji Restoration. They fled to northern Honshu and eventually established the Republic of Izo in Hokkaido on January 27, 1869. The Republic adopted a government structure inspired by the United States but granted voting rights only to the samurai class. The emergence and subsequent collapse of the Republic of Izo can be viewed as a reflection of the power struggles that characterized Japan during this transformative period. This internal conflict ultimately culminated in the defeat of the Republic, allowing for the consolidation of power under the Emperor. The downfall of the Republic of Izo serves as a poignant reminder of the complexities inherent in determining Japan's future when disparate groups vie for control.